You're working within the two worlds. medical students, pharmacy students and Aboriginal health workers all together and I think they're quite complementary and I believe that we need more of it. We need, I'm actually a nurse so that's my background so I think you know, nurses should come out and physios and speech therapists because it's about all learning together about healthcare so I think it's really important. Katrina and I would like to welcome you here to fight. Um, on, and to Kanarak and Awara country on behalf of our elders. And I was very, very touched with the introduction Eleonora gave to us this morning because it's exactly why we're here for, to share and understand a little bit better each other. One of the aims is to understand the issues uh, of uh, uh, remote and rural health, the different matters and issues that one should be aware of. Um, another one we would like to achieve is this interdisciplinary learning with these mixing groups and hopefully achieve that by the end of the day and have the students embracing that new concept. My name is Ian Lee. I'm doing the um, Northern Territory Medical Program. Uh, I'm a third year pharmacy student at Charles Darwin University. And when we have stuff like this, when you actually get to go outside and you get to interact and you get to see things from like first-hand point of view, I think it's really good and the things stick more than just reading them from a book. <laughs> nurses, Aboriginal health workers, we're all a team. We all work together and we're all working towards the same outcome which is better Aboriginal health. In terms of practical teaching, of skills and of working together in, team, in a team, there is no substitute. It, you cannot learn how to be a team uh, working, learning apart. <laughs> Getting to listen to uh, Dr Ian Norton from the National Critical Care and Trauma Response Centre. Uh, there was uh, representatives from the, the CDU Pharmacy Department uh, and also uh, Fred McConnell who's uh, spent like an enormous amount of time, I think over 40 years, in remote health. It's, it's uh, just good to get different perspectives uh, on, on health in the NT. So I've never really had any experience in rural or remote health, um, so I just want to know more about it because so far like the thought of living in such an isolated community scares me but I do want to have some experience and I do hope to do a placement here. I think it's not about a whole heap of people with all their good wishes rocking into a place going I can do this really good. It's about respecting the, the people that you're actually looking after and getting their viewpoint and what's important for them. I think as a, an opportunity to uh, open people's eyes to First of all, Aboriginal health and its importance. And secondly, its relevance to health uh, generally, and particularly in the Territory. I think it has been an important day. Mm -hmm.